Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster, and welcome back to Let's Play Wing Commander. Last time we destroyed a Rolari Destroyer that was hiding in the Dakota system. We also got a Silver Star, which completes our trifecta. We now have bronze, silver, and gold stars. Uh, there's one more medal that we can get, or one more award we can get, which is a medal, but we'll be getting that later on, so we'll talk about that later. But for now, let's see what we're doing here in uh, Dakota system today. Oh, we're getting out of here soon. Oh, that's good. Ah, what's in Kurosawa system? I wonder if that's, uh... I don't know. I wonder what's there. Oh, good, we got to be able to kill Rafi. That's cool. Uh-oh, another kill Rafi ace. Hmm. Okay, well, Paladin can help us. Oh, thanks, buddy. Yeah, we haven't seen Paladin in a while. I wonder how he's doing. Ho-ho, <laughs> but I know how we're doing. Look at that. 73 kills in 10 missions. What? Marcy, son. What? Hey, it's our old fun. It's our old friend Paladin. Ah, oh, it's good to see you too, man. What's going on? Oh, so you're listening to our conversations, eh? Thanks. Thanks for, uh, you know, a little thing called privacy there, Chief. Hmm, Baktosh Redclaw. Oh, so you've engaged with him before. Okay, cool. Ah, that's all right. We have experience taking out nobles. We've dealt with Thrakath before. So no worry there. Oh, man. Well, does he know what he's in for? Aw, oh, crap. He's got a Jalfi, but that sucks. That's not good, because Jalfis are really hard. Yeah, and he actually does have really deadly aim. Like, he can he can rip you to shreds if you're not careful. So, but Fortunately, I have a strategy for him, so if we run into him, we'll be ready. Ah, thank you, boss man. Appreciate that. All right. Oh, well, hey, no problem. We've played a major part, and we're a major. Get it? Major, major part, you know? I thought it was funny. <laughs> uh, someone mentioned, uh, I think there's a Wikipedia article, someone posted a comment this, that I guess the boss man is Chinese, I believe that's right, so, that's kind of cool, I mean, we have a bunch of different, uh, different, uh, nationalities represented aboard the Tiger's Claw, that's pretty cool. Um, I also made the mistake earlier of mentioning that, uh, H Hunter is actually Australian, and not British, as I previously reported, so, my bad, viewers, my bad. Okay, but enough of that, let's see what we're doing today. Okay. Ah, the Zai Wing. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, there's a Kelrathi supply combo. We need to take him out. Yeah. All right, yeah. You think... What kind of a stupid-ass question is that? Yeah. Can I take it out, please? Oh, there's something I don't know. Okay. Oh, that's fine. Whatever. We got this. Oh, we still got the deadly shot in the entire Navy. Whatever. I'm not worried. Okay, so we have to... Ah, we get to fight some Dark Ears. Okay, they're not too bad. Uh, dark Ears are actually that, are not that tough. I'll show you the strategy for them there in a little bit. Okay, fair enough. Okay, so we just need to take out the transports and not worry about, um, uh, about anything else. Oh, but we get to destroy them all. Okay, no problem. Oh, so if Red Claw attacks us, we just ignore him and attack the Dark Ears. Three minutes? Yeah, that's what I thought, too. Thanks, Eric, for your help with that. All right, let's go get those transports. For, oops, first zone. I will auto pass this. Okay, let's see what we get to deal with today. Oh wow, there's a lot of them. Uh oh. Oh boy, it looks like five are accompanying that transport. That can't be good. Oh, but they're crants. Okay, fortunately those things are easy. So remember the strategy for crants. What we're gonna do is just uh, wait for them to make his move, and then uh, no. Permission denied. I want all these kills. So, again, just kind of lock onto him, wait for him to just stop for a second. And also get to ram him a couple times, no worries there. We have pretty thick shields in this uh, raptor. And then just kind of wait and blow him to kitty heaven. Hopefully. Come on. Come on. Man, my gun's charging pretty slowly. That sucks. Right, come on, come on. We can do a little bit better than this. Ram! Ram him! I'm glad the other uh, Karathi ships don't attack, because that could suck. Come on, there we go. Jeez, that took way too long. So, anyways, four more of these Krants, so I'll take them out real quick and be back once they're dead. Alright, and I got the last one for us, no problem. Okay, now let's talk about this Dork here. Oh, shut up. Now, strategy for the Dork here. Break and attack, go get Okay, now. Oops. Come on, come on. Okay, now you want to avoid that fire because that fire can rip your shields apart. So what you want to do is kind of just wait, get close, then ram him, 
and just stay with him, and he should go down eventually. There we go, just like that. So, just avoid the fire as you approach him, then ram him, and he should go down. While we're kind of saving our shield, so that's a good thing. Okay, zone two. All right. Zone two looks pretty clear. Let's go to nav, or sorry, nav one looks pretty clear. Let's go to nav two. Okay, let's intercept that second door here. Okay, who do we got here? Who wants some of us? Okay, Jalfies. Okay. We definitely want to send Knight to attack against those Jalfies. Now, someone said Backtosh was around. Okay, yeah. So, if the Jalfies taunting you, it's probably an ace. So, let's see if, see if the ace starts to go after us. Where is he? Is that, where's, who's that guy? Oh, that, there's Backtosh. Okay. Now, strategy for Backtosh is you want to engage him, get as close as you can, and he's deadly shot, so be careful. Okay, he missed us. But when he finally engages you, what you want to do is you want to just launch his mi your missiles at him as quickly as possible. Okay, he's not going after us anymore, so... Okay, well, if it's not going to be different, then why are you going to engage us, you stupid jerk? Well, Knight's going after him anyway, so that's good. Okay, Knight seems to be going after him. And if Knight takes him out, that's okay. I mean, that's that's not that big of a deal. Um, just as long as one of us take out the, the Karate Ace, we're in good shape. Okay, let's invite Taunt him a little bit, see if he... Will come after us finally, because I want to take this guy out. Okay, he's shooting at us, so watch out. Alright, come on. Okay, well, come get us then, you jerk. Well, anyways, I'm going to take a minute and I'll be back once he decides, uh oh, he's shooting at us. If he starts shooting at you, you want to run, because he has a deadly shot. So, anyways, uh, once he starts engaging us, I'll, uh. Oh, there he goes. Okay, never mind. So, he finally, finally engaged us. So, okay, now, just lock onto him, just like you normally would, any, normally would any drothy, and fire your missiles at him. And don't be afraid to use all your missiles until he goes down. Ah! He escaped me. Crap. There he goes. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ugh, okay, I'll... Dang it. Okay, I'll be back once I'm in close proximity. Sorry, viewers, for the... Come on. Come on. I've lost like four missiles at him. Go down. Ugh! Okay, well anyways, that's the strategy. For some reason, I'm not working today, so I'll be back once he's dead. There we go. Got him. That took long enough, but we finally got him. Okay. Knight, form up. Knight, form up. There you go. Good. Okay. Now, all we have left to do is take out this Jalfi, and then we will start dealing with this dork here. The strategy for the, Jal the Jalfi is just like before. Just lock on it behind him. And, and there you go. And blow him to bits. Okay. Okay. Now, remember the strategy for these dork ears. Here, let me take a second and I'll collect my thoughts and I'll be right back. 